Hello folks, fellow YouTubers and friends. Uh, we've done a little modifications to this uh, machine here to see how things work. Uh, got a little trouble here. <laughs> what we did is we modified the work beam up here, the power, uh, power bar. Uh, in the last video, it was 1.41 to 1 ratio. We now have a uh, three and a half to one ratio. It's three and a half feet over here, one foot over here. Uh, our weight is 80 pounds, so it should take approximately 280 pounds full to lift this. We have, uh, however, a 140 pound pendulum. And uh, you can see it's swinging right now, so I did have it, it picking it up. So, all right, we have 80 pounds here, 140 pound pendulum, three to one ratio. We're gonna see how much power it takes to lift it, how much power I need to put in, and uh, can it be done? All right, here we go. something different with this machine. <laughs> it never fails to amaze me. The pendulum weighs more than the weight it's picking up, but it's picking it up under a much greater strain on the three and a half to one ratio. Uh, but I'm not putting a whole lot of energy into it. 
So I'm, I'm doing this video mainly so that those that are trying to help me with the mathematics just maybe can get a, a little bit different perspective on this. Uh, let's just assume we had a 6 to 1 ratio, then I would need a much heavier pendulum. But once the pendulum is swinging, it takes very little effort to keep it moving. Now, with a 6 to 1 ratio, the less we move, let this move up and down, the less energy you have to put into it. But the more weight you have to have in order to pick up weight over here. And by the ratio, you move this a little bit, this moves a whole lot. Okay, hopefully uh, this will give some people a little better perspective. And I'm going to change it up and to do something different so that we can all take a look at this thing from different views. Okay, have a great day. i got to go to work now.